Thank you all very much for giving me the privilege of serving you for another term on Langley Township Council. I am deeply honored by your trust. We face an exciting term ahead, and I am particularly happy to be facing the challenges of this new term on a council that is almost 50% women and has the highest percentage of women councillors ever. This is a new first in Langley Township's long history and one to be very proud of. As we move forward from today in making decisions about our community and its future, we need to keep our residents in the forefront. We need to engage them and consult with them in more meaningful ways as we plan for what Langley tomorrow will look like. We need more sustainable and less tumultuous rates of growth. We can no longer use a business as usual model. Growth must be balanced with the needs of our residents for schools, health care, transit, parking, parks, and public safety going forward. We need to build strong and resilient communities that will stand the test of time and create a high quality of life for all our residents. People and community need to come first and be foremost. This council will need to more rigorously and vigorously lobby higher levels of government to get our fair share of infrastructure like schools and health care sooner rather than later. We will need to resolve the development problems in Willoughby like lack of parking and ensure we do not repeat those problems in other areas of the township. We need to ensure that our first responders have the best training possible. We will need to build age-friendly communities going forward and that provide enough uh, affordable and accessible housing for our seniors. We need to protect the affordable seniors' housing that we already have, especially in the manufactured home parks throughout the township. We need to build a new Alder Grove pool and revitalize the redevelopment of the Alder Grove downtown core. We need to protect our forests, farmland, rivers, water, and Fort Langley heritage for future generations. We also need to live within our means. New growth does not pay for itself, and it is unfair to foist the costs of new unbridled growth onto the backs of long-term residents and taxpayers. It is time to implement more meaningful forms of community amenities provided by developers and to ask of each project how exactly will this development make Langley a better place to live? It's not just about simply providing more housing. But perhaps most important of all, we need to genuinely listen to our residents, to hear your concerns, and to respond to you with respect. You are Council's boss. We exist because of you. As a Councillor, I believe it is my job to listen to you to speak up on your behalf, to do my homework, to ask the tough questions that need to be asked, to do what I say I'm going to do, and to stick by you and by what I have said I will do. This is my pledge to you. Please know that you can call me at any time and I will listen. Thank you again for entrusting me with this very important job.